Hello my lovelies, welcome back, it's Nisha. And today I wanted to come on and to jump on a bandwagon. I saw Brianna do a video on her current MAC uh, favorite lip combinations. And I have quite a few myself, so I wanted to share them with all of you. Um, I'm sure all of you know all these colors, but perhaps you don't know to wear them together. And I thought I would share my favorites with you. As I always say, all of our complexions are different, so what works for me may not work for you. But I wanted to share my favorites, especially for this time of year, for fall, because um, it's always seasonal. So let's share my current fall MAC favorite lip combos. Let's get started. So the first one is um, the Lip Liner Whirl. And um, everybody knows uh, this lip liner, especially with the current um, Kylie Jenner lip trend going around. Um, everyone seems to have this lip liner. And this, as you know from my uh, recent haul, which you might or may not have seen, um, this is a recent purchase of mine. And I am really, really loving it. Um, it's not easy to pull off a pink lip for my complexion, but this is a gorgeous, gorgeous lip liner. So I'll swatch it for you here. There it is. And as you can see, it's a, I hate to say your lips but better, but it is a your lips but better color. It's a little bit deeper and it's gorgeous. Um, the uh, lipstick that I like to pair that with, um, there's so many, but this is um, my current favorite with it, is Viva Glam 5. And um, here's the color, and I'm going to swatch it for you right next to the lip liner. There it is. So you'll notice from all of these that I'm showing you that the lip liner, as it should be, is darker than the lipstick. And the way I like to do it is I like to line my lips with the lip liner and um, fill it in. I, I sometimes fill in the entire lip and put the lipstick on top. And sometimes I fill in most of the lip um, or the outsides of the lip, like most of the outsides of the lip. So that's what it looks like. Um, and you can see if you kind of fill it in a bit, that's the color it becomes. And it's beautiful. It's just a gorgeous lip combo. So that's my first one. Second up is um, the Lip Liner Boldly Bare. And here it is. They'll be very similar, but um, you can see it right there. Um, a gorgeous, gorgeous color. You've all seen them. These all look very, very similar. Um, there it is, Boldly Bare, a gorgeous lip liner, um, a little more um, neutral, not as much pink. And I like to pair that with Cherish, right there, you can see it right there. It's very, very similar. Uh, the lip liner is just a little touch darker. So you can see how beautiful a color that is. Very, very neutral, um, a perfect uh, beigey, um, light beige, light nude um, lip combo. So I really love that, and that's something that I wear a lot. Um, next is a, um, should not be a surprise to anyone, is the Lip Liner Spice. And I don't know if it even makes sense for me to hold these up. Probably not. Um, but I will. And this is Spice. You can see it right there. A beautiful, darker, darker color on my complexion, but absolutely gorgeous. And I like to pair Spice with Velvet Teddy. Um, I've mentioned that before. I love, love, love this lip combo. And you may think that it doesn't go together but it absolutely does. When you put a little more, when you fill your lips in with spice, it is gorgeous. That's it side by side. And when you fill it in, 
that's what it turns to. So you can see they are all different and that is just a gorgeous, gorgeous color. I love it. Um, just gorgeous. One of my favorites. Next up, I have three more. Next up is the a lip liner in strip down and that's the color right there. I'm running out of space. There it is, stripped down. Definitely more of a brown tone, um, but I love brown tone. Those seem to work on my skin tone. And what I like to wear with that is fresh, is it freshly? No, it's not freshly, it's just fresh. It's just fresh brew. It's not freshly brewed, it's just fresh brew. So um, there it is. And that is gorgeous. That's it, just um, side by side. And I am gonna put a little more lip liner in there so you see kind of what it becomes, how I wear it. There it is. Beautiful, just gorgeous. So, you know, when it starts out, they all look pretty similar, but you can see they're all, they all have a different tone to them. So that's the next combo, which I have really, really been loving, and um, beautiful. So uh, next up is what I have on my lips today, and this is a lip liner that I have actually been wearing for years. It's one of my favorite, favorite MAC lip liners, and it is in the color Plum, and here it is. So I've had this for years. You can even see this is old packaging from MAC. There it is. It's kind of a dark swatch, but it's, as the name suggests, plum. It's a dark, dark plum color. Um, and I just love it. Um, I am deathly afraid <laughs> of red lipsticks. Um, I don't think I can pull them off. I'm still, I'll wear them, I'll buy them, I'll wear them, and then, you know, I think, oh, they don't look bad. I'll look in the car visor, and I'm like, no way. And I take a wipe and I wipe it right off. And I go back to one of my little comfort colors here. But um, for me, plum, especially when you fill in your lips with plum, is pretty daring. So for me, and uh, probably not for most, but for me. And I like to wear plum with uh, Hug Me. And that's what I have on today. There it is. Hug Me. And um, that's really, Hug Me is a little more pink. I'm not sure why the camera is pulling a little more neutral, but it is a pink. And um, when I darken that out with a lip liner, that's kind of what it becomes. It's more mauve -y. And um, it's gorgeous. It is what I have, like you can see, it's what I have on my lips today. I've repeated that like three times, but it is. So it's not, um, it's not too scary when it's on. So that is another combo. Lastly is the combo that I love. This is my go-to combo for nights. Um, it is a browny, maroony color. I absolutely love it. It's, it looks very scary in the tube, but it is my favorite lip combo that's dark. Um, and here it is. It is the Lip Liner Cork. Cork is my favorite lip liner of all time. Um, it's just beautiful. It is like a rich, I hesitate to say brown, um, but it is like a brown lip liner. Here it is. It has some maroony, some beige tones. It's beautiful. And the lipstick that I like to pair with that is Coconutty, and it's a frost and it is gorgeous. Here it is. It's so well loved, and this is not my first tube. This is probably my like 10th tube. Here it is. Coconutty. It's my favorite, favorite lip combo, 
and it's a light color when it's swatched there, but when you actually deepen it up, which is what I'm doing right now, you can see how lovely that is. It is gorgeous. And if you are somebody that likes to wear a lot of neutrals, um, if you like to uh, wear a lot of black, but you're afraid of a red lipstick or really dark lipstick, that's how I'll sum it up. If you're really afraid of dark, dark red and maroon colors, this is the color that you should gravitate towards. It's perfect um, because it's not too out there and um, you don't need to be afraid to wear it. Um, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous color. Finally, uh, an honorable mention I'd like to give to uh, the lipstick Creme de Nude by MAC. Um, I am not going to say the give this a specific lip liner because this goes with everything. This is a beautiful lipstick that can top any lip color. I like to actually use this with a lip brush and so, um, so much of the time, so much of the time? Yes. So often I actually take a lip brush and I just put a little bit of creme de nude in the center of my lips to kind of give it like an ombre effect or to kind of highlight. It's a beautiful, beautiful color to do that with. A lot of people do that with concealer. I have done that with concealer um, and I don't mind that. This is just a different um, option. And since we're talking about MAC lipsticks, um, why not talk about this lipstick? And um, actually, if we want to talk about a concealer, the concealer that I do use is the Studio Fix Concealer to do the same thing with. So, in the same category, MAC. But if we're talking just lipsticks, Creme de Nude is perfect and a great color to highlight the center of your lips with. Um, I have not talked about lip glosses, but there are many lip glosses. Just to name a few, I like uh, Viva Glam 5. I like see-through. There are so many. Um, my favorite, favorite uh, lip gloss of all time is, is actually Buxom's White Russian, but that's not a MAC lipstick, so we're, again, we're off on a tangent. So let's bring this train right back to my favorite MAC lip combos. So this is a tag that I wanted to do um, and I'm not sure if it's a tag but I saw Brianna do it and um, I thought I would do it as well and share my favorites with all of you. So thanks Brianna for doing that video and I hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, perhaps it gave you some new combos to try on yourself. I certainly hope so. I hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you are. Mwah! Thank you for spending about Let's see, about 13, 14 minutes with me. I certainly appreciate it. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. Please comment. I love to read all of your comments and communicate with all of you. And I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Bye-bye.